He's reflecting his own view of the world because he didn't do it on his own. Without Al Gore's internet, where would he be today? Without Al Gore, who invented the internet, how in the world could Obama have uh, raised all of that money? You see what I'm saying? And without the government cheese, how, how could he have gotten where he is? So I ask you, ladies and gentlemen of the Savage Nation, do you finally agree with me that he's showing the world that he is a communist? Because only communists think this way. Now, by the way, he's not the only leader in the world who thinks this way. Uh, Castro, Fidel Castro has thought about thought this way since the, uh, well, since he was born. Uh, Chavez thinks this way. The communist Chinese think this way. The ex-Soviet Union thought this way. And now, of course, your Democrat Party thinks this way. So I will ask you, business owners who listen to the Savage Nation, did the government build your business? Did the government make you what you are? Is it the government that keeps you in business? Is it the government that protects your business? You and I both know what the truth is. You and I both know that the government harasses you at every turn. City, state, and local government makes your life as a business person almost impossible, certainly unprofitable. But why don't you call the show? Now, it is true that most of the people listening to the show are working people or business people. I would think that those who are illegal aliens don't listen to the show. Those on welfare don't listen to the show. Uh, those natural-born leeches that Obama seems to be appealing to don't listen to the show. But if you do listen to the show, do you think that Obama is right when he says that you didn't build that business on your own? Tell your story. This is your opportunity. 